hello guys in this video I'm going to show you how to use arrays with your visual basic windows form application this will be a very basic demonstration of using arrays so let's get started I will just take a button and resize it and I will change its text as array and just double click it and first of all I will show you how to declare arrays so for example I want to make the array of names so basically I want to uh, have a list of names I have several number of names and I want to make a list of those names so I can um, store the these names in an array so first of all how to declare array just write dim name and this bracket shows uh, visual basic that it's an array and whatever number you enter between this bracket will tell uh, visual basic that this uh, array contains the number plus one members so if you enter here four then it will contain five names because array starts from zero right and then as usual you need to give the data type so for example we give string data type to our name array so this is the declaration for the array now for the assignment what you can do is this should be names right because this is a list of names right? so for assignment you can just write names zero is equal to and you can give any name and in the same way I can assign the rest of the four names right so the array starts from zero then goes to one two three and four right and name can be different I'm storing different names okay now how to uh, retrieve these names uh, as a useful uh, entity for example I want to show the first element of the array which is mark then I can just show it in the message box so I will write message box dot show names and in the bracket you can pass the item number and you can just show the name mark which is the item zero so I will just run my program so my program is running and when I click this button it shows the first element of the array now for example I want to iterate or I want to show all the names one by one this I can do by using for loop so I will write for i is equal to 0 to the length of the array so we can determine the length of the array by just copying the name of the array dot length right and then I write minus 1 why I am writing here minus 1 because we are starting from 0 right and the length of the array is 5 so that's why I am writing minus 1 here and in here I can just cut this message box from here and paste it here 
and instead of zero I will write I so it will iterate the value of all the name from 0 to 4 in this message box one by one using this for loop so when I run the program and when I click this button it will show the first name which is mark second name Julie third name fourth name and fifth name right so in this way you can use arrays in your visual basic windows form application I hope you have enjoyed this video. Please rate, comment and subscribe and bye for now.